I don't know if I'm gonna post this. I really don't, but I have to record it. I have to record it. So, this is my walk of shame. As my friend calls it, my grounding, I'm grounded. Uh, this is where I stop playing, hopefully, some of the ego games that I love to play all the time. I hope so. <laughs> Holy lordy. I'm alive. I do want to drink the canal. So, you see that? any of that that's that's been my last day given by police officers uh, I'm not clear-minded right now I am clear-minded but this is an important point of release for me from a tad bit of, of Ego, grandiose, self-clutching land, which I slip to inevitably, always. So, tore up from the floor up. So, sorry, that's probably bad video skills, but uh. So, this is also a confession to, uh, if I do air this on YouTube, it's a confession about drinking. I've struggled with drinking for a while, and I was not AA. I'm probably going to trot my happy ass back to AA right now. I'll show this to Yolanda first and see if she okays it for you. So I need to induce feelings of guilt so I don't do this dumb shit again. I don't know how I can do that. Probably the best way to do that is to go back to AA because that will induce lots of guilt. And uh, go back to actually relying on source instead of just pretending like I know everything. Don't get me wrong, we all have the spark in us, but the ego is the most devious thing. Oh yes, this as well. A little head bump there. The ego is the most devious thing ever, and even through people like me who I know I offer valuable things for you guys, everyone. Uh, but sometimes I probably appear like I know more than I actually do or that I'm powerful or something. And uh, there's truth in that as well, but there's also a lot of ego there that I don't like to look at. And I struggle with the same shit that everybody else does. I don't like to look at that either. Life changes are in store. I 
that's all for now. Bye.